Hello and welcome back. In this short lecture, we're going to learn about how to assign licenses to the users. These steps can be performed either from portal.azure, which is nothing but your Azure Active Directory, or from Intune, or you can also do it from Office 365 Admin Center. So let's do it uh, everywhere, in fact, with one of the users. So let's take Ben user, uh, which is unassigned. I can go back to Active Users. To see all my users and then I'm clicking on my user which is uh, showing here as unlicensed click on ban and use and go to the license here you can check out what are the licenses has been assigned so in this case there's no licenses assigned so I'm gonna assign for enterprise mobility EMS 5 uh, and also I'm gonna assign for office business premium and I can click on save that's how you can assign the licenses now let's do the same things from other steps uh, in this case from EMS console or uh, from the Azure portal console let's go to Azure Active Directory and click on users you would be seeing here all the list of users and uh, in fact Ben has been already have a license but you don't see here uh, if you want to see here you need to go click on that you specific user go to licenses it will show you the assigned licenses here in this case there are two licenses already assigned now let's take another user Chris in this case go to licenses this user shouldn't have any licenses to assign we can click on license assign and this will show us the available licenses in this blade I'll simply click on these licenses I can assign and advanced assignment options if you want you can choose it for example a specific options you don't want to allow for example I don't want to allow maybe a stream office 365 features or maybe uh, specific rights into the EMS for example I don't want allow for the Intune I can simply take out uh, by turning off these features this is how you use the additional licensing options click on OK and assign this of you assign so we did also assign from active directory which is azure active directory let's also assign from intune portal as the third step for another user so simply go to all users here under users so this would again navigate to the similar uh, in the in the background to the azure active directory so i can take maybe the stem david email id and I would simply assign licenses the steps are quite same there's no difference in fact so I'm just taking out the required permissions I don't want to assign a specific to application level so that's it uh, this assigns uh, the required licenses uh, all I have to do is I have to wait for a few minutes to refresh to get this so in this case all the license has been assigned this is how you assign the licenses